Well, hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Miss Crochet and Coffee here. And today we have a hodgepodge. Why is it a hodgepodge? It's because it's TGIF. Thank goodness it's Friday. You're going to hear dogs goofing in the background. Don't worry about that. They're just out there playing. Either way, um, this video is just a random video of stuff that I got today that I don't feel like unboxing next week. Plus some of this stuff you might not want to wait to see. So I'm just saying. First things first, you see that little blue thing? You see it? You see it? Someone asked me, and I don't remember who it is, so if it was you that asked me about it, please feel free to comment down below that it was you. Um, I will be using this tool tonight in my live. There is one thing that's missing from this stack of stuff that I randomly got, and it's Tic Tac cases, which y'all all know what Tic Tac cases look like. Um, if not, join me in the live, and I'll show you. So um, this adorable little thing, is a square drill pin. Now, I'm not too sure about like the flexibility of this thing. Seems a little willy wonky to me. I would get annoyed at the fact that it keeps moving. But I was asked, what did I think of these? And I was like, I don't know. I've never, I've never really used one. So I purchased one, a very expensive one, $10 for a pin. I don't think I've ever spent so much for a pin in my entire life. Either way, we're going to test that out, okay? Okay, so that's, that's the first thing. Now there's this. This comes to us from Etsy. Uh, editing Leisha will put the name of the shop on the screen for you now. Um, I was testing patterns this week. Sorry, hold on. Sorry, Rachel. I was testing patterns this week and I broke one of my hooks. And so I was like, my hook... My hooks are very old. They're like at least 10 years plus. And I was like, it's time for some new hooks. So the shop's name is Yarn Shop For You. And I ordered this, I ordered this like three days ago, actually. Hold on, what's today? Today, I ordered it on the 23rd of April and I got it today, which is what, the 25th? So yeah, um... Is it the 25th or 26th? One of those. Y'all know what date it is. It doesn't matter anyway, because if you're watching this past Friday, then it, the date don't matter. Either way, it's just an 11-piece set of ergonomic hooks, and it tells you all the sizes, and they're just the hooks with the padding, and they're rainbow-colored. Isn't that cool? They're the hooks with the padding because the ones that are just aluminum, unless you're using them for short-term use, they will give you what's called crochet finger which is where that metal piece sticks into the side of your finger and then your finger starts going numb. So to avoid that, I buy the ergonomic hooks because I crochet often and for long periods of time. So that is the next thing we got in the package. It is really cool. Um, it even has a conversion on it. So if you're not from the U.S., uh, it'll tell you the sizes for there. <laughs> All right, so that's the second thing we got. So we got two, we got pins and crochet hooks. Now we're gonna hold off on that diamond art club real quick. And we're gonna go into this. And yes, I did try to open it. Don't, don't judge me. All right, so let's get into this. This is not good. This is gonna be a quick video, sort of. So when you open it up, and I didn't touch anything, I just opened it. So I wasn't struggling on the video. <laughs> when you open it up, you get this. Well, that's cool. I'm not sure what that is. That's some kind of paper or something. I'm guessing that's tracing paper. And this is a nice carrying case for what's in the box. An instruction book, which I've never seen an instruction book for one of these before, but okay. You have whatever this thing is. I'm going to think that I think that's a clamp that you put on it. You have a charge cable. You see where this is going? And I originally was looking for an A3 light pad, and then I realized, why do I need something that big? Where I do do big diamond paintings, usually the, the bigger ones come from Diamond Art Club, and this size is perfect. This one is an A4. It's a little bit bigger. I paid $35.99, I believe, for it. On the back, I thought it was cool that it has uh, the things on the back so it doesn't slide. And it does support USB, so let me, let me find it. There's a USB slot. And I actually have a plug down here, so we're going to test the light on this because I don't want to get it and then it not light up. So 
nice long cord and my plug luckily has a USB thing on it. So we're going to plug this bad boy in. We're going to try to, oh cool, it has an indicator light on it to let you know that it is on and working. We're going to just tap it. <gasps> Whoa. All right. Tap it again. Tap. And it's not super duper sensitive. And I like that. And I like the size of it. It's a, it, it seems to be a little bit bigger than a, the normal A4s. And I like the size of it. It has a ruler on it. It has the black edging, which is what I wanted. Kind of looks like a TV screen almost. So I thought that was pretty cool. And then when you're not using it, I can unplug it. First, I couldn't plug it up. Now I can't unplug it. This cool little bag. And it says designs. And if nothing else, Mr. Coffee will use that, that tracing paper because he is the artist. I just do like diamond painting and crocheting and stuff. So nice big carrying case for it. I'm actually going to put all of its stuff in there. Ugh. Matter of fact, we're going to put all of our stuff in there. Was that weird that it just floated it across your screen? Probably. All right. So then we're going to trash this way. We're just going to put that on the floor. Y'all don't care about trash. So there we go. We have a light pad, crochet hooks, and a square drill. Yeah, if I didn't say that before, that's a square drill pin. So I'll be using that whenever I start working on my custom again. I haven't diamond painted in a week, which is a nice break, I have to admit. It was a nice break because I really needed it because I have a lot more diamond paintings coming in. As you guys already know, Diamond Art Club has their new stuff coming out on the 7th. Well, they released a sneak peek today, which is, again, April 25th or 26th. I can't remember. Um, it looks like The Little Mermaid. So if you haven't gone, seen that, go check my group, Crafters Anonymous with Miss Crochet and Coffee and Rachel Wright. Um, also, if you didn't notice, right now, Diamond Art Club has a sale. Buy two, get one free. You know I had to get some. You know, I have to. I have to, folks. I have to. After seeing that that picture of the stockpile, I was like, nobody can ever say anything to me about how many Diamond Art Clubs I get. There are people out there that collect AliExpress ones. There are people out there that collect New Frog and all this. I can, I'm allowed to collect Diamond Art Club if I want to. If you don't like it, oh well. Either way. So, we all know how this works. Now, about this package. I ordered this on the 22nd. This is the fastest that a diamond painting has gotten to me. On Easter, I ordered two paintings from another company, which will be in on Monday, so it says. We'll see if it does, but it hasn't gotten here yet. But this kit was purchased on the 22nd because it randomly came into stock. For those of you who check on diamond art clubs or you know you guys were upset because jessica rabbit was sold out jessica rabbit came back into stock magically out of nowhere like a unicorn fart in the middle of the woods just came back in the stock and i got the email and then i was alerted to it somebody was like hey you might want to go grab one of those i was like hold up what so you guys know i had to grab it so again I'll give you a hundred cool points if you can tell me where that saying is from. It's called not bad, just drawn that way. That saying comes from somewhere. Can you get can, can you get the hundred cool points to tell me where that saying is from? It's from one of my absolute favorite movies, which was one reason why I just had to have this painting. But yeah, anyways. So after I was alerted to the fact that this had came back in the stock, no sooner did I get it that it was out of stock again. I was flabbergasted at how quickly it came into stock and went back out of stock. So if you got your hands on one of these, and I've only ever I've only seen two other people with it, which is Stitcherista, of course Stitcherista, and a woman named Brenda in my group. So I was just like, oh, I can't wait for mine to get here. <laughs> Sure can't wait. So we're going to go through this as if you've never seen a Diamond Art Club before. So buckle up. Here we go. We have our vinyl toolkit bag. 
which inside the bag, you will have two plates of heart-shaped wax, or what you should find inside your bag, I should say. There was a YouTuber this week that was missing her wax. But you have a drill pin. Will you focus? You have a drill pin, a blue squishy. You will get some baggies. You'll get two plates of that heart wax. The other one's in there. I'm not pulling it out. Yep. And then I dropped the other one. Again, wax, clear boat, drill pen, and then you also get a three-placer, which is in the bag there. Can you see it? There you go. All right. So, not that you'll give two craps about the toolkit, because you want to see the actual painting. So, let's open the painting. We'll get to the drills in a minute, which, as you can see, there are some pretty colors. This one was packaged up 4-7-2019. Fresh off the line, folks. All right, I'm going to see if I can find. And if you didn't realize it, yes, it is a square. But it's not just a square. Yeah, you know where that's going. So we're going to get this out of here. We're going to roll it backwards. Now, I cannot wait to lay my eyes on this. This will be the first time I see it in person, obviously. So I'm pretty excited. So I'm not looking at it. And if you're trying to figure out what I'm doing, I'm doing this. So inside of here, you have the page that, you know, has your nine steps. Y'all don't care about that. Um, I think I might have rolled up my little sheet. So we'll guess I will figure that out here in a few minutes. There we go. There she is. Isn't she beautiful? All right, so this kit seems to have not come with the little inventory strip, which is fine. Let me make sure I'm not, it didn't fall out or anything. All right, no, this one did not come with the little inventory strip, which is fine. But, oh my God, you guys, look at her. Isn't she freaking gorgeous? Let's get a close-up, shall we? Are you ready for your close-up, Jessica? All right, so let's look at the drill fill. Nice, clear drill fill. You're going to hear a snap. There we go. Straighten you up again. Not bad. Just drawn that way. It's a 47 by 82. That's what she's supposed to look like, her thumbnail there. She has 40, count it, 40 colors. And it's because everything gradients. Look at the gradients. Mandy Manzano is notorious for amazing gradients. I'm trying to figure out why this is so dark, but I'm going to guess that's shadowing. Oh, I can't wait to see this done. Her hair is like two different colors, which is kind of cool. Her dress. And then those number ones, all that white, the white speckles you see, are where her square AB gems go. All right, so we're going to bring you back down so you can look at her and not my room again. Don't look at my dirty room. All right, you sitting down? Sit down. All right. Sorry, I got a little bit of the DAC asthma right now. I'm trying to get it together. Deep breath. Okay. So let's get into these drills. If you don't like the noise of the crinkling plastic, please mute your phones for like mm, 30 seconds. All right. And she comes with a boatload of drills. So let's just... She's on. Okay. So let's look at some colors, shall we? Let's turn them this way so we can see the numbers. So in case you like a number, because we're going to look for those AB drills. There's a lot of that 772, 815, 912. That's one, please. Holy moly. Focus. Focus. We got some dark purples and such in there. That's a dark purple. There's that 740. You know 741. <gasps> oh my God, look at that, you guys. If I can stop shaking, I'm shaking you guys so bad. All right, here we go. There are the AB gem squares that go on the speckles on her dress. Sorry, life happened. All right, so again, those are her square ABs. Look at them shine. Can you tell Maggie's in a fabulous mood? All right. 
So here we go. Ooh, I really like that color. $8.92. That's pretty. All right, so that's sleeve number two. And there's one set of AB gems in this kit. There's not more than one in this kit. And I don't think there's going to be more than one set of square ABs in the squares, at least. Hold on, where does that color go? Uh-oh, we got a straggler. He just wanted to shine like the rest of them. Poor little guy. And they're all alone. This, is, this thing is heavy. Let me just put that out there. It's a lot of drills. Oh, yeah. Definitely going to love this kit. And then a bunch of 310s. All right. So. There you have it. 47 by 50, or I'm sorry, 47 by 82 square AB. Isn't she just absolutely gorgeous? The hair, the dress, like Mandy Manzano put her foot in it. Get it, girl. All right. So that's it for me. Kids are home. Husband's home. Time to go enjoy the weekend. If you are watching this on Friday, I will catch you in my live. If you're watching this on Saturday or another day, I will catch you some other time. But that's it for me. I hope you guys are having a great day. If you do catch this on the weekend or something, I hope you have a great week. I don't know. Just have a great something. Either way, that's it for me, folks. Thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up or give it a thumbs down at this point. I don't give a crap. If you're not already a subscriber and you would like to be, please feel free to hit that subscribe button and the bell to be notified anytime I randomly decide to put up a video. And believe me, folks, it's random. Either way, that's it for me. And as always, remember, be kind, be courteous, be cool. Bye, guys.